What up, good people? Huge shout out to Hard Genesis for allowing me to review the 2020 Genesis G90. Today we are viewing the 2020 Genesis G90. This particular model wrapped in an Uyuni white. Man, Genesis make that sound so fancy. But for the length, 204 inches. Height, 58 inches. You have a wheelbase of 124 inches with a ground clearance of 5 inches. Right here we are looking at a 3.3 twin turbocharged V6 engine pushing out 365 for the torque 376 at 1300 RPM for the 0 to 60 in 5.3 seconds for the MPG Highway 25 City 17. Here's the sound of it. Right here we are looking at a 19 inch alloy wheel. Genesis redesigned the grill. They call it the new face of modern luxury. Now we are making our way inside of the vehicle. We are greeted with black Napa leather seats. Right here we're looking at an analog cluster gauge. On the left you have your engine temp, on the right you have your gas gauge. In the middle you have a 7 inch colorful digital display. Now we're bringing it back to your standard steering wheel control. You have your Bluetooth and volume button alongside your cruise control setting with your plus and minus pedal shifter. The buttons right here have your blind spot detection, lane departure with your traction control. You have your gas and trunk relief with your electronic parking. On the door panel, you have your memory seat setting with smart position care. Looking down on the door panel, you have your standard unlock and lock with your one touch window control with mirror control. On the door panel, you have your genuine wood grain finish. Right here, we are looking at a 12.3 inch touchscreen display in high definition with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay running the latest Genesis Connect with real time traffic. One cool feature that the Genesis G90 have voice memo. Check it out. Hey, artist speed, need to do a car review. On the dash, you have stitching detailing. You have more genuine wood grain finish throughout the car. It actually feel like wood. Genesis then took it to the next level. You have your engine start start button, aka your push button start. Right here you have your dual climate control. In the cubby area you have your USB with your wireless charging pad. You have your shift knob. This particular model is an 8 speed automatic transmission. Beside the shift knob you have your view, parking assist, auto hold with drive mode. 
Watch as I demonstrate drive mode. The buttons right here have your heated and cool seats, heated steering wheel with your rear visor control. We just unveiled the cup holder area. In the center console you have your 12 volt outlet and it's pretty deep. We done made our way up to your interior lighting with your moonroof control. On the rear view mirror you have your SOS Safety Connect compass with Genesis Connect. You have soft closing automatic doors. Now we're making our way to the back of the vehicle. Back here is very spacious. You have your air vent with your two 12 volt outlets. Right here you have your one touch window and visor control. Right here is your rear center control where all the magic can happen. Where you can control your passenger seat, heated seats, with your sun visor and you have a climate control. Wow, this is pretty amazing. You have your radio controls where the driver can listen to what you want to listen to. We done made our way to the center console where you have a USB and your 12 volt outlet. With your cup holder area. We done made our way back up to your interior lighting. Now we are making our way to the cargo area. Imagine that 15.7 cubic feet. Wow, you can put some golf clubs in here. This is pretty spacious. One thing I do love about this vehicle Everything is premium on this vehicle. You get your Lexicon premium audio. You get your genuine leather. You get your uh, nice displays in the back seat. I really feel like a president in a Maybach in this vehicle. So, um. Once again, huge shout out to all Genesis for allowing me to review the 2020 Genesis G90. If you need any information about Hall Genesis, I'll leave the link in the description below. Like always, good people, browse your channel, like, subscribe. I look forward to seeing you next video.